you want to get into medicine but you don't have A-levels or you don't have a degree, there are still routes to enter. The main way is through an access to medicine course. And in this video, we'll be going through what that is and also outlining some of the medical schools that accept that. So access to medicine courses are designed for individuals who wish to study medicine at a higher education level, but don't possess the qualifications required for entry, like A-levels or other level three equivalent qualifications. These courses are aimed at adults who have been out of education for a long time or don't have the required qualifications to enter into medicine. The main purpose of these access courses is one, to provide individuals with the skills to enter higher education and secondly, to give them qualifications that they can then use to make an application into medicine. So access courses are designed to be studied full-time or part-time. They are provided by a college, so a partner college, and a medical school then verifies that course. They are usually around one year in length and can be completed alongside other commitments such as work or family responsibilities. It's important to point out that these programs are not suitable to those who have come from a traditional educational background. So that's if you've done your A-levels and you've missed the minimum requirements, you can't now go on an access course because it's tailored and made for people who have taken extended breaks outside of education. Access courses should be seen as an alternative to A-levels or a level three qualification. However, the qualifications you get before your access course are also still relevant. So these are things like your GCSEs. Universities also use that in their criteria to decide whether to give you a place or not and use this in addition to the access course grades that you also get. Importantly, you may still need to take admission tests such as the UCAT. So it's really important that you're looking at your eligibility based on that medical school's program. If you'd like help on your medical application, apply to our program here. Students who wish to apply to medical school through an access course must have completed a one-year access course that leads to an HE diploma, so that's a higher education diploma. And this diploma must be in a relevant subject such as science or healthcare with a core content that contains elements of biology, chemistry, maths, and other science units. Now, these are all relevant to pursue a career in medicine. It's important to point out that the level of these core units are equivalent to A-level standard, so they still will require Require a significant level of commitment. So the access to higher education diploma requires the completion of 60 credits, where at least 45 of these credits must be graded at a level three in order to meet the entry criteria for most universities. However, for access to medicine in particular, it is expected that the great majority of credits will be graded at level three. There are a few universities in the UK that accept access courses. University of Oxford, University of Bristol, University of Manchester, University of Warwick, University of Edinburgh, University of Glasgow, and the University of Sheffield. Medical schools have different criteria for accepting access course applicants. So it's really important that you're checking the eligibility of that school and also looking at the provider of the access course as some medical schools verify certain programs. So that's also another helpful way that you can decide whether to do an access course at this college over that college as well. It's important to note that not everyone's journey into medical school is the same and there are various different routes that you can get into medicine. One of the main ways is through an access course where if you come from a non-traditional background or you've taken an extended break, you can apply to medicine by this process. I hope this video has given you a good understanding of what an access to medicine course is and also outlined some of the universities that accept it. Access to medicine courses were really created to ensure that we're widening participation into medicine. Now, what that means is we're ensuring that everyone gets a chance to apply to medicine. If you'd like help on your medical application and want to know about how to choose the right medical schools for you, check out this video here where we talk about how to apply with strategy. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.